Hello, hello, and welcome to day four. It's the 31st of May, 2018. Feeling really motivated again today. I've got some good news. I will just talk to you briefly about last night though. Um, I was pretty low. I was very up and down as I went to sleep last night. I think doing the activities I've done over the last couple of days have brought up a lot of feelings that I would normally hide away from and it's given me no choice but to deal with it, which is really great. As I, and as I go through, I'm gonna feel much better. But yesterday was quite a difficult, uh, well, last night specifically was quite a difficult night. I am feeling much better this morning. I want to talk to you a little bit about uh, meditation. It sort of fell in my lap, if you like. Obviously, I said to you that back in day one or two, that talking to people around you is really important. If you can communicate how you're feeling, that is really positive and I would advise you to do that. So I have been talking to my mum and I've been sharing this journey with her and I've been showing her these videos and she's really proud of me, which is great. And she's feeling inspired to do stuff with her body confidence as well, which is awesome. And she found this meditation, we believe in the law of attraction. Uh, I, I will probably talk about that in later videos. And we believe in the universe. And so we just sort of, she just came across this video out of nowhere and it's exactly what I'm doing. Sort of going through your body and thinking about the parts you dislike, the kind of things that you say to those parts. And as I mentioned my legs, I would say, I say really nasty things about my legs. And then I would say, I'm grateful for my legs because I'm... So it's exactly the same almost of the process I did yesterday, but we found it in a meditation. So that, um, it was called Love Your Body Better by uh, Louisa Tanner Munson, I think. I've put it in the description below. So that was, that's my top tip for the day. Rest, um, meditate, really embrace your feelings because that is what I've been doing over the last couple of days. It is hard, and I want to just give you a heads up, like I'm sure you saw how emotional I got yesterday. It is a difficult process, but I trust that this time in three months, I'm going to feel tons and tons better, and it'll make this whole time worth it. I've just realized I don't think I mentioned that I, I did a workout this morning. After doing that meditation, I was feeling really motivated, and I did a workout. Uh, it was just strength work, so I worked on my upper and lower body strength, but it lasted probably half an hour-ish, maybe a little bit longer. And I feel really great this morning. I'm wearing a t-shirt, as you can see. I think when you do a little bit of physical exercise, you do feel better within yourself and you do feel better in your body, which gives you that little bit of added confidence. And I haven't worked out for a really long time. So I think that doing this process is making me feel motivated to want to look after myself, which is fantastic. So my message for today to you guys is you deserve happiness there will always be people in your life that make you feel like you're not good enough make you feel like you're not pretty enough not slim enough whatever it is that you're self-conscious about there will be people in your life that bring that up for you therefore if you're seeking happiness on the outside on the outside it's only ever going to be short term it's never going to be long term because happiness is an emotion happiness is a feeling and that is what you feel on the inside and you deserve to be happy and following some of these things that i'm doing and i really do feel happier than I did even four days ago. So by following these things and following these videos, I really think that would make a difference to you as much as it's making a difference to me. Have a really lovely day and I will catch you tomorrow.